Now you speak. After giving me the silent treatment for two weeks. <laughs> what? What's so damn funny? How you told me you'd die before you were back in uniform. What news from the road? How come Yahara picked this place? It's the furthest port from all the trouble. We used to vacation here. Back when we schooled in Sybil. You schooled in Sybil? Our parents are... were... well off. Old money. By the time the dead invaded, they'd wasted their entire fortune chasing some... wild scheme. If Yahara hadn't figured out how to get us enlisted... <laughs> we'd have starved. That explains the attitude. It's their way of dealing with the world. They don't mean it most of the time. <coughs> you sure you were right? That cough's been getting worse. I'll live. No rest till dawn. No rest till dawn. I hope my work is still You're right there, Forge Master. The heat isn't getting to you. Heat's nothing. Humidity's nothing. But the gods will take me before I travel by ship again. You know, all we need is a few well-placed rifts. And I could have you back in the peaks in a heartbeat. Oh, thank you, Death God, but no. The only one longing for me back there is the hangman. You had news, Forge Master. I've learned a group from my former order has been seeking a relic. They can have it then. My fight isn't with the knights anymore. This isn't some trinket, nor. It's a piece of sacred armor, passed down generations. We cannot let it fall into their hands. They've been away from the peaks for a while. Couldn't we reason with them? That's a dangerous plan. Last I heard, the armor was entombed in Sun Shelter. I would start the search there. Good to see you. You all right? Got your lamb legs back already. No thanks to that tub you chartered for us. No other captain would risk harboring a guard killer. Besides, she owed me. Let me guess. Another army friend. A friend at first. A fling after. We parted on good terms, and she owed me for the memories. What kind of memories? Well, <laughs> there was this one time we were, um... That's it, we're off. You can't play deaf and dumb forever, you know. Fire. What? The hamlet's on fire. Damn. Let's go. Invigorating.
Lucas said Yahara was staying here. Let's go get them. with the coalition. Reeks of black powder? Ill-mannered like a mower with mites? That's the one, yeah. They left just before all the trouble with the dead started. They're not coming back, are they? Not if I can help it. There's a man camping out on Nomad's coast. People say he's a bandit trying to get back on the straight and narrow. And how are his former gang members taking it? Poorly. I dread to think what will happen to him at this rate. A mysterious woman came by here on her way to Cape Reunion. She couldn't stop raving on about her ancestral duty. You think she's mad? That, or at least religious. In any case, those back roads are hardly safe. A settlement out by Goatfoot Gorge is on its last legs. If it hadn't been for that coalition captain helping them. A coalition captain? Here? Is he recruiting? From what I hear, he could use all the help he can get. You know, there's a burial ground for coalition soldiers just outside our hamlet. Perhaps I'll visit sometime. Pay my respect. No better time to confront your mortality than now. You're from the front. Won't you? Please. My husband, sir. Dawn. Under Field Marshal Summer. I haven't heard from him in weeks. I was sent home months ago, lass. Let's try asking someone else. Any news from Sybil? Looks like they packed up and left already. Damn. Looking for the one with the blue jacket? Stinks the black powder. Sounds like them, yeah.
they left as soon as the dead came to first anchor. I tried to talk them into hiding with the rest of us, but... It didn't work. They would have been found anyway. The dead are all over this place. Said they were headed to back harvest. Only way there is through jagged ascent. You could still catch them if you hurry. I'd best get going then. Insignia. What is it? The soldier's memorial. We should go back. You can go back to the camp if you want to. I'd like to take a look around. Are you serious? Absolutely. <sighs> All right then. We might as well do it properly and light the vigils. Vigils? The fire watches for the dead. You don't let it go out. These don't look like any headstones I've seen. They can't bring the bodies all the way from Dawn. So, people make these shrines instead. This one. Again. Again. What is that? <laughs> what we called him. <laughs> he was a mower herder from out in the sticks. Had this accent we could barely make out. Every time he'd fire the cannon, he'd shout, Again! Again! <laughs> it's stuck. Narwak. Echar Nar. This one was the face. Prettiest woman I'd ever laid eyes on. But pity me, was she cold. You never got along then? Not for lack of trying. Why didn't you want to come here at first? All I've known are camps, trenches, and memorials, Enki. I've spent my life in the first two, and I'll end up in the third. Find. 
the head stop. <laughs> Had the best hangover cures. Knew how to sleep with his eyes open. Impressive. Every other word he spoke was a lie. But you never could hold it against him. Ebram Nib, Kurdmek, Dobnom. What are those things you're saying at each shrine? An apology. For not being there for them. To hear their stories. Does that mean they'll be forgotten? Only if you let them. to receive them, to cleanse their souls and preserve their memories. These were my comrades. My friends. I... I didn't think about them until we were here, but you shouldn't be the only one that remembers them, Enki. I know. But I will cherish them all the same. I think I should mend my boat, go back to fishing. First it was Bandit, now it's the dead. Feels... You know I'm still mad at you after three peaks, right? Would you have accepted my help if... If I'd have known you were Death himself? Still haven't wrapped my head around that. But you lied to me, Enki. Don't ever do that again. Understood. What's that?
What are we going to do, Captain? The de That's a pretty speech, Captain. But those people look exhausted. And you are? Norvanek, Sapper. At your service. Azra Dell, former captain. Came back to find my home ravaged, so I thought I'd help. I'm not gonna mince words, Sapper. These dead are like nothing I've ever seen before. These people are brave, but bravery alone won't cut it. Our only option is to inflict enough losses on them in a single battle that we have time to dig in. Sounds dire. So what's the plan? No, we need some specialists. A few veterans that served under me still live nearby. Problem is, we're no longer on best terms. They want nothing to do with me. Perhaps you could convince them. I'll see what I can do. I see her. Tread softly. Back. Get back. At ease, Sophie. Captain Azra sent me. Well, tough luck. I'm no longer with the Twelfth. You were in the Twelfth? I had no idea. Uh -uh. You've heard of us. I was at the matchhead when the dead almost broke through. You held them off long enough until we could bring in the cannons. I lost every friend I had that day. Swore I'd never pick up a musket again. The villagers out by Goatfoot Gorge need you. I know you and Captain Azra didn't part on the best terms, but could you be a hero again? For their sake? <sighs> Damn it. I'll meet you there. determined she'll come it might be the last time she'll ever hold a musket she'll come I'm here on Captain Azra's orders. He's in need of a fencer. After kicking me out? He's got a lot of guts. Sending some... sapper. We've need of you. The people at Goatfoot Gorge. I know you. You're Vanek. I am. I've got people back at the peaks. Told me there's a hefty price for the god killer's head. Is it worth your life? <laughs> it's certainly worth yours. He was a good warrior. What a dumb waste. He wouldn't have listened to reason. And you had to defend yourself.
find? On your feet, soldier. We... Hold on. Dozo? I'll be damned. It's Nor, the powder monkey. <laughs> I haven't seen you since I dragged you out of that cave-in at the crush. Oh, you wouldn't have. I lost a couple of toes because of it, so they sent me away on medical discharge. I never even got to thank you for that. You could do one better. The folks here at Goatfoot Gorge need some dead gone for good. As couldn't muster the guts to look me in the eye, could he? Consider them done for. But I'm not doing it for him. You hear? It seems people in the Coalition have respect for you. You do a good thing, you get a good thing back. It's not that complicated. <laughs> I got everyone I could. Zeng didn't make it. A shame, but we'll manage. Get ready! They could be here any moment! Last of the rotters. Come on over, Sapper. You've earned your rest. 
That put a serious dent in their forces. And it's all thanks to you, Sapper. I was just doing my part. Even so, the people put something together as thanks for going above and beyond. This is as good a place to rest as any. What's that? Come on, men. Come on in. Do your worst. Thank you for saving me. They'll just send another. 
in another. No. What are those bandits want with you? I used to be in their band. Till I realized there's no way to live. I did some awful things. So I ran. I took as much loot as I could. I was going to give it back to the people I stole it from. But they haven't given me a moment's rest. What if I got that loot back for you? Well, that would mean the world to me. I buried it in caches along Nomad's coast. Hopefully the others haven't found them already. Just make sure you stay out of sight, all right? There you go. Volunteer again. Don't stand it. So is he's one man against a bunch of thugs. witnessed your arrival long ago. You have wandered too far. And too long. Follow me up the cliff. All will be made clear. This is pointless. She's just some mad woman. She might be. But I'm not letting you off the hook that easily. These bandits really have it in for Jiri. They get their hands on him. Everyone's sins catch up with them eventually, Nor.
some time, though. Huh?
Organized. The old powers are swept away, new ones rise in the ensuing chaos. Today's ruffians are tomorrow's kings. There's a worrying thing.
Essentially scum free. This is as good a place to rest as any. You can't turn anyone down, can you? I've turned plenty of people down. Really? <laughs> like who? I... There was... <sighs> hmm. That's all the caches. We should let him know we got them. Back up, Harry. We ain't sharing. Too bad. <gasps> You dirty rat, Jerry. Stole my loot, killed my men. I wish I'd killed you slower. 
Never mind. You'll have to do. No escape. I shouldn't have left him undefended. They would have found him eventually. I didn't even think to ask where the loot's from. I have no idea who to return it to. You rid the Nomad's Coast of a deadly criminal band. Probably saved dozens of lives in the process. I'd say that loot's a suitable reward. Lucky blow.
The mind is a slate. We have known you, and she. I was raised to welcome you. Bring you to this place. Just a little bit higher. I'm Enki, the god of subtlety. No one's ever heard of me. I didn't say it like that. And I have no memory of her ancestors, whoever they are. I neither had a cult, nor wanted one. A cult? No, Hanshi. You gave us something better. You gave us power. Raised us from poverty. Allowed us to survive the harsh centuries. Not much longer now. Come, come. You broke your own rules, didn't you? Gave her magic? Absolutely not. 
but... Yeah? I do remember this place. A perch to watch the world from without being disturbed. When the droughts came, I tried to save it. Never imagined anyone would notice. Ready to fight. These are dark times. The power we have has brought with it violence and unwanted attention. Does it involve a lot of madmen with goat emblems? Lately, yes. And for this, we must bid Anshi's gift farewell. I'll see you at the summit. last. Where did you find this? A boon from you. Shed during your travels in the above. It gave us everything. It is an honor to be the one to lay eyes on you. Whether sheep, male, a ape, imbop. Male. that I didn't stay out of history's way after all. Careful with the landing.
Shame I can only kill you once. this then Those knights haven't been at the peaks for a while. Do you think they'll listen to reason? Do you really want to take that risk? I don't know, Anki. I'm sick. None shall pass! I'm here to parley. Let me speak with your commanding officer. Sentinel Gers, this is not seeing anyone. Especially not civilians. Tell him Norvanek wants to see him. He'll know who I am. Ah, uh, 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 oh. Follow me. No sudden movements. Understood?
disease, Heeg. Whatever it is, I'm sure it can wait. Uh, uh, a woman is here to see you, Sentinel. Name of Nor Vanik. Vanik, you are an enemy of the judges. According to their missives, my killing you should put me in their good graces. Why come here in the first place, Nor Vanik? Because I've met your judges, and I know they're dishonest. But more importantly, because they've run the peaks into the ground, turned the rest of your order against its people. They're not worth your loyalty, never mind your life. Ah, so that's it. I'm supposed to give up on my mission on an infidel say-so. I've said my piece. Do whatever you want. You've come to me with neither fear nor trickery. I respect that. You have earned yourself a trial by combat. In the traditional manner. And that means... It means a proper jewel. Steel on steel. No guns. Or bombs. Or black powder trickery. Best me, and my knights will leave this place. And if you win? I, I promise to make it quick. But use your black powder weapons, and the deal is off. Understood? You ask for it. <laughs> <laughs> What you said of the peaks? Every word of it. I swear on my life. The people need champions now more than ever. Then we'll set off at once. But before that... Here. The judges tasked us with finding this armor. It was made to serve the just and those who fight tyrants. I trust that you can make the most of it. I will. Thank you, Sentinel. We should take the armor to Jung. He'll know what to do with it. give you any trouble? They took some convincing. So Ramaha's poison didn't affect them all. Means there's hope for the Order yet. Thank you. The armor has dents that need fixing, but even in this state, it will serve you well. Wouldn't you rather have it, Lord Master? It's a warrior's tool. Wear it proudly. Stay safe. Mm. Mm. 